Only on 7 News, take a look. Trash turning Denver alleys into dumping grounds. 7 News asking questions after a 7 News viewer told us this mess had been here for weeks. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez is getting answers. And Lance, you've learned the problem is illegal dumping. And there was so much debris dumped in this alley, you couldn't drive around it, so some motorists started driving over it. Now, once we started asking questions, the city sent out a crew to clean things up. We're tired and sick and tired of seeing our alleys look like the city dump. Robert Durant says it seems like every time someone moves out of a house or apartment in the area, the discarded furniture ends up in his alley. Why this alley? I have no idea. Uh, probably maybe because the alleys are still dirt. We counted seven sofas, six chairs, and a couple of mattresses in a two-block stretch of alley between Stewart and Raleigh on Chester Place. Duran says he can't help but wonder if some of that furniture is infested with bed bugs. I know what a what a pandemic that, that these that these bugs are. And once you get them, it is almost virtually impossible to get rid of them. We see bed bugs about twice a year. They get reported from our crews. And what we do is we call Denver's Environmental Health and they take care of the issue. Christine Downs of Denver Public Works says the city limits large item pickup to once every nine weeks to save money. Is nine weeks frequent enough to deal with the heavy items that most people leave behind? Well, the what residents leave behind nine weeks is we are finding is an appropriate amount. Downs says the problem is illegal dumping, people who come from outside the neighborhood. She said the biggest problems are in neighborhoods that border other cities. Now, Downs says that uh, they can't post an inspector out here 24 7, so they're asking residents to help be their eyes and ears. If you see illegal dumping, get a license plate number and call police. Live in West Denver, Lance Hernandez, 7 News. That makes sense. All right. Thank you, Lance.